Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Tonight, we are saying goodbye to not only a News 2 legend, but an overall TV legend. I am talking about our good friend, PJ Ryle. That's right. PJ <laughs> has been a friend and a mentor to everyone he's worked with at News 2, and now he's <laughs> hanging up his hat after so many years with us. Some members of the News 2 team have a send-off for you, PJ. Hey, congratulations on your retirement. Yeah, I've always felt you're the heart and soul of Channel 2. Your encouragement and support throughout the years has meant so much to me. He's the grandfather of News 2. So we got the big news this week. Gray Soaps, of course, announcing, PJ, that you've been named employee of the quarter. Could not happen to a nicer person. Well, he's, Congratu he's retiring. He's, what? He's retiring, not employee of PJ is retiring? Yes. I'm lucky, I'm fortunate uh, to be able to call you a friend. I think everybody should be blessed enough to have a guy like PJ Ryle in their life, especially early in their career. I personally am thankful for how you've mentored me and really made this place my home. You are the brand of Count On Two, and I hope you realize that. PJ Ryle? PJ, gosh, that's even bigger news that you're retiring. I did not know that. Um, gosh, seems like you just got here. But um, congratulations, PJ. You are an amazing human being to me, always offering me words of wisdom, always giving me a reason to smile. And of course, you gave me an amazing opportunity back in the 90s, of course, with our original broadcast, The News at 10. But uh, seriously, you really are something special to all of us here. You enjoy yourself. Nobody deserves this more than you, buddy. I love you. I adore you. Gonna miss you, buddy. PJ, thanks for a great career and uh, for a job well done, my friend. Happy retirement and God bless. As you were, PJ. <laughs> A little bit of maker's mark for you. I toast you, my friend. You will be missed here at the station. That is for sure. All my years, one of my favorites. Absolutely. A friend to all. I know I will miss his hellos. He always walked through the newsroom in the morning to say hello, then after lunch, and then before everyone went. So congratulations, PJ, on your retirement. That's all the time we have tonight on News 2 at 6 o'clock.